Happy Halloween everyone! Welcome back to my channel. This is Demelza's Delights 100% cruelty free and vegan channel. If you're new here I do vegan and cruelty free videos featuring makeup tutorials, uh, sometimes I do baking and vlogging. <laughs> but today's video is all about the spectacular treats that Lush Cosmetics have released for Halloween and I have actually got the entire range to show you. If you are looking for something fun and cute for your children for Halloween uh, and you don't want to go down the sweet treats route then you could definitely have a look at these goodies. Everything that I mentioned in today's video will be linked in the description box down below. Have a look at that one. And I'm just going to start pulling stuff out of the box. I am going to start with this cute little guy. He is the Bewitched Bubble Bar. Now, if you're not familiar with Lush Cosmetics, they make bath bombs and they make fantastic bubble bars. I love a good bubble bath. So what I do with these bubble bars is I actually like to chop mine up and then put them through a strainer. If you don't want to chop them up and buy the strainer, then you can just crumble them in your hands under warm running water and they make so many amazing, beautiful smelling bubbles. So as I said, this is the Bewitched Bubble Bar. It is a cute little black cat with gorgeous yellow eyes. This bubble bar shares the same scent as the Sultana Soap from Lush and the Blackberry Bath Bomb. So if you love either of those two, you will really love this one. And if you're wondering about this plastic looking bag on the outside of the packages, when you order from Lush online, they come in these cellulose bags but they are vegetable cellulose and these ones are actually uh, biodegradable so you just put them in the compost and they break down. In here is actually the Bewitched Bubble Bar which I just showed you and I chopped them up and I also chopped up the Sparkly Pumpkin Bubble Bar. Again another nice bubble bar for beautiful bubble baths but this time it is a pumpkin which of course we all think about pumpkins when we think about Halloween and autumn. I tried out the two of them together. I think I think next time I might try them individually because I would like to see what color the uh, sparkly pumpkin bubble bar goes. I've seen other people do it and it's like a beautiful orange water with gold luster all through it and of course all of the bubble bars from Lush uh, if they've got any type of glitter on them it's always plastic free glitter it's actually made from seaweed so when you wash it down the drain rest assured it is not going to be uh, polluting our sea life so those are the two bubble bars in this halloween range the sparkly pumpkin and the bewitched bubble bar i'm going to move on to bath bombs now eyeball bath bomb this is a new bath bomb for the halloween range and Smells like rose with uplifting Brazilian orange oil and balancing rose. You won't be able to help but look on the bright side. This eyeball bath bomb makes an amazing show in the bath. It rolls and swirls, black spills out and what looks like blood red water. The smell of this one is not my favorite. However, it is a lot softer than you think it's going to be. If you're into really spooky treats for Halloween, you will love this bath bomb. The next bath bomb is the Lord of Misrule bath bomb. Absolute stunner in the bath. Hashtag bath art. I used this bath bomb just this morning. <laughs> I used it with a mixture of the two bubble bars. So I had a really murky blackish grey tinge to the bath water and then I placed in the Lord of Misrule bath bomb. Now this has got a beautiful mix of spicy patchouli, it's got black pepper. I was so 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 impressed by this bath bomb. It's actually the first time I have used it. Everybody raves about it and I embarrassed to say it took me this long to try it. <laughs> it has the most beautiful emerald green outer and then when it bubbles away it's got such an intense dark berry red center. Lord of Misrule generally comes out around October and it sticks around for Halloween and Christmas. It's here to stick around for a couple of months so I definitely recommend you get your hands on it. Don't wait like I did. It is a Dana in the bath. <laughs> this little cutie is Monster's Ball. I have already demoed this one. I absolutely love it <laughs> and um, that's why I've got more. It shares the same scent as Calacus with neroli and lime in it and it is so interactive in the bath. 
really really love this one so you can catch my mini demos of this little guy he's so so cute uh, on my instagram nz loves lush i've got another one and i'm gonna get a couple more too <laughs> this one here is the ectoplasm jelly bomb jelly bomb yes you heard right <laughs> so you can see here there is a little ghost on the front of it and these particular discs here are the jelly-like substance that kind of foams out bubbles out into your bath i don't personally love the jelly bombs <laughs> i find them really messy and i don't really like the consistency however they are very moisturizing and a lot of people with dry skin will tell you that they really like the jelly bombs lush do an entire range of jelly bombs so if that's something that you're interested in you can just check out the links below and this particular jelly bomb as you can see oozes green and purple so it's very funky and as you know, the ectoplasm comes from the ghosts. And it was only last night that I watched Ghostbusters, the new one with the female cast. That was really, really funny. And I laughed when the ectoplasm was going all over them. <laughs> so I really encourage you to try the jelly bombs for yourself and then let me know what you think. Let's make it a discussion in the comment section. <laughs> Speaking of ectoplasm, this is the newest shower cream from Lush. It is grapefruit and tangerine. It does really smell delicious. I'm going to show you something funky. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so this is a very thick inconsistency uh, shower cream. You can use it in the bath or in the shower. It's really nice and moisturizing for your skin. And the best thing about it is it glows under UV light. So you can have a lot of fun with this in the shower. I forgot to say that the entire range this year, the entire Halloween range from Lush is vegan. Uh, and they also make a naked shower cream as well. If you're not into the packaging, then you can get your hands on the naked version of this shower screen. It smells so delicious and it is very moisturizing. I need to go wash my hands now. <laughs> so as I say, if you are not into the packaging, you don't want the plastic bottle, then just grab yourself the naked version. And then this one here is the ectoplasm wash card. So another invention from Lush are these perfume wash cards. And for Halloween, they have bought out ectoplasm as a scent. These are perfect for travel. Oh, so good um you would just you know instead of taking soap with you you just take these little sheets you can easily tear off a third or a half of it you lather it between your hands with water and you can use it all over your body leaving behind that beautiful scent so i really love this invention i really think it's perfect for travel and if you're looking for a cute wee gift these retail for four dollars each so they're not too expensive last but not least is the ghost in the dark so this one is so 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 cute he glows in the dark so it's lots of fun for the family he's not a scary ghost either he's a cute kind of fat ghost <laughs> he also shares the same scent as the avo bath bomb a very illuminating wash with refreshing lemongrass and uplifting bergamot oils charge up in the light to chase away the monsters at night he is very cute <laughs> Yep, that's the last of it. That is the Halloween range. I hope you really enjoyed this Halloween video featuring the Lush products. They're all vegan this year, which is awesome. Hopefully with every range they bring out, it will continue to be vegan. I'm off now to have another bath with these creeps. <laughs> Do have a look at the whole range on their website. Please give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel. I bring lots of videos on vegan and cruelty free things. Have a happy Halloween and I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye.